Hey y'all, this is TCA Gaming, and in this video we are going to open up this Obsidian Flames booster box. It's taken a lot of effort for me to not see what is in this, uh, or what you could potentially get inside of this box. I know that there's some really good stuff. I've seen some of the Charizards, I've seen mixed takes on whether or not people like them, but I've tried not to look at them too hard. Anytime I see previews, I just kind of skip over it. But, I'm ready to open up my first box and see what we have here. So technically tonight, this well, this video for this box is gonna come out after the live, but I'm recording in real time before the live where we're gonna be busting some of these. So this is indeed my very first box that I am opening up, even though you may have already seen me open up some of this Obsidian Flames in a live video. Now, I wanna hit some of these Charizards. I mean, who doesn't want a Charizard, right? But if I do, what do I, do I do? I grade the thing. There's the code card. So pack number one, we have a cool looking Pidgey. Okay, got a reverse hollow and a hollow. There's about what is there, six Pidgeys in there. Seven Pidgeys. There, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine Pidgeys. Wasn't expecting there to be nine Pidgeys. All right, pack number two. Got a just a, a reverse and a regular hollow. Wait, no. Two reverses. A double reverse. Is that NK? I thought you were supposed to get three hollows or a combination thereof with the reverse hollows in every pack. If you guys are looking to buy any codes, I am I do have the website fairly up to date. Wiglet. <laughs> oh man. They did they redid Diglet. Turned into a Wiglet. I don't have a crazy amount of stuff up, but I'll have some some things you guys are looking for, like Obsidian Flame booster packs. I just now got up the World Championship deck, <clears throat> code cards, and some of the Elite Trainers. Weasel, Drillbur, got a Toxitricity. Man, I'm still getting over that um, the Flash Fire booster box that had all the signs of being resealed, and then once we opened up the packs that had flash fire cards inside we even pulled the mega charizard ex so we got a gold in this one artazon ooh and a tyranitar ex that looks pretty sweet man a lot of lightning stuff got a gold card there triple triple star looks like uh some kind of windmill card there's Togekiss. Let's read it and see what it says. So once during each player's turn, that player may search their deck for a basic Pokemon that does not have rule box or have a rule box and put it onto their bench. Then that player shuffles their deck. EX and Pokemon V have rule boxes. I was getting ready to ask what is a rule box, but I guess that makes sense. That's what this is down here, this little rule box. We've got one Art Rare, two EXs, and we've gotten one Gold Rare. Nice looking Eevee there. I know a lot of people are already talking about my 151, even though Obsidian Flames has just come out, where they're talking about worlds, because everybody's <laughs> over it in Japan right now. Well, not everybody. A lot of people are over there right now. It would be cool to see the world championships in Japan that's just a long flight long flight back it was like 22 hours or something plus you have like the you're gonna have a whole day on the plane but then you've got the time to pre prepare for it when you get back as well got a Litwick Charmeleon and a Victini so it's all fire right there to me that's just I think it would be minimum one week you'd have to take out for something like that. And I do not have a week to give up for my family right now. Palafin. We got another art rare. I'm not even sure what they call it now. They changed it up from Galarian Gallery, Character Rare, Character Secret Rares. There's the regular Palafin. But it looks like Japan has some really cool stuff over there. All right, we got a full art Absol EX. I think that's our first regular full art. I don't know if we're gonna 
get another one or not. I can't remember. Well, I don't know what the, the pull rates are for Obsidian Flames. I heard for Paldi Evolved it was pretty good. We did, we got that Gardevoir in our first box. Man, I think I, I got a 9.5 on that from CGC and ended up pulling like 130 bucks or something crazy. I was, I was not expecting it to go that high. Poppy. I'd probably have to say so far my favorite card so far would have to be that. Ooh, well, I was going to say the Tyranitar, but this is pretty cool. So we got a full art. Art rare, I think. The Vespequin. Vespequin. Decent amount of hits so far. We're still, we're just now getting into the second half of the box. There's another Entei. Got some decent regular hollows. I've seen the Entei, I've seen Darkrai. Who else have we seen? There's Scissor. Clay Doll. Ooh, there's a Dragonite in the set. Maybe, maybe we'll hit one of those. Dragonite or Charizard. We hit the Tyranitar. I mean, we haven't hit anything like super crazy yet, but still. There's a nice Absol EX. Toxitricity. Man, Pokemon Go packs are super cheap right now. Look at that. Reva Varum EX. Everybody dogs on it, but I've always thought Pokemon Go was a fairly solid set. You have the three original starters in Hollow, and you have them in Radiant, which is pretty cool. Ooh, that's nice. Look at that Nine Tails. Man, I would I'd probably say that's my favorite artwork so far. Got it. Got to be something from the original era, right? Scovelin. Got a decent amount of hits in here. I wonder if there's like a 15 hit box. We're still cranking through it pretty quickly. Togekiss, Pawnard. Reaver. There's that dark rag again. Ooh, greet it. Still getting a, a few hits. Do you think we'll have one more hit in the last? So we got four packs here, including this one, if you include this one. There's Greta, Greta. Japan has cooled off quite a bit with a lot of their stuff, so it's becoming a lot easier to get the boxes now. Mirror it on. So there's the the hit in the last packs unless we have one more in the very last one can we get a Charizard or a Dragonite alright no Charizard no Dragonite alright so we'll go over the hits again for this box you guys let me know if this is a strong box or not we got the Mirrodon got the Greedent Nine Tails probably my favorite right there the centering doesn't look too great so probably won't grade it we got the Rev of Room that was, I mean that's pretty cool we got Absol the Vespaquin Palafin Artazon Artazon Pidgey, which is interesting. Absol, got a Victini, Tyranitar EX, and then we have a Palmot. Not too bad for an Obsidian Flames box. We had a total of 3, 6, 9, 12. We had 13 hits out of our 36 booster packs. Let me know what you guys think about Obsidian Flames. Are you digging this set? And what is the pool that you are trying to get?